Manta rays are also known as manta rays, and they have this nickname because they are poisonous. Manta rays have a special tail with a poisonous sting on it, which is bayonet-shaped. When the manta ray pierces the stinger into other animals, it causes them to be poisoned. They are very toxic and very dangerous. So if you want to raise them, you must be very careful Don or mantis poisonous. The manta ray is one of the more exotic fish. From the appearance, they are quite different from other fish. Because they look like bats. They have the word bat in their name, and they even have wing-like structures on both sides of their bodies like bats. Their teeth are very powerful and can grind many things, even very hard things, will be ground by their teeth. Manta rays are also known as manta rays because they are poisonous. Their tail is quite special, with a poisonous sting on it, which is bayonet-shaped. When the manta stings into the bodies of surrounding animals, or into the bodies of humans, there will be a toxic reaction. Is the manta ray poisonous? As mentioned above, manta rays are poisonous, and their poison is in the stings on their tails. When a manta ray thrusts this stinger into a human body, the human reaction is not always the same. But generally speaking, the reaction will be more obvious. Because the toxicity of manta rays is still relatively large, but sometimes human beings will have symptoms of blackening and whitening, sometimes confusion, dizziness, chills and other symptoms, and mild symptoms such as swelling, pain and so on. Even if the stinger is pulled out at this time, the toxicity will not be weakened, and the skin may be necrotic, and fall off. Therefore, after being stabbed by manta rays, they must be treated in time, and the thorns pulled out should be burned in time to avoid their harm. If you want to breed manta rays artificially, you can dispose of the spines on their tails before breeding, so as to avoid accidents.